Hi, I'm Steve from Kelvin, and in this video, I'd like to talk to you about getting your Kelvin working. Now, in order to do that, you're going to need a very small screwdriver, either flat blade or Phillips, three AAA batteries, and a USB charger of the type that you get with any mobile phone, or you can use a USB socket on, say, a computer or a laptop. Now, what's in the box? Open the box, you'll find a red tag, give that a gentle pull, and that will allow you to take the tray with the unit out, and underneath the tray, you should find an instruction manual and a USB lead. Now take the clear, transparent top off the lid, and that will allow you access to the unit, which is the, the receiver unit and the transmitter clip. Plug in the USB into the socket. Uh, take your clip, Lift up the little tag, which is next to the power button, underneath the Kelvin, the clip. Plug in the lead. It's a long plug, but actually it only just goes into the socket a little way. And then just plug that into your USB charger, and the red light will come on. And that will stay on for about half an hour, and then when it goes off, it's fully charged. Now we need to put the batteries in the base of the receiver unit. You'll find there's four small screws, Take your screwdriver, take the screws out, just like I have with this one here. Uh, just take off the black plate, and you'll find that there's the place for the three AAA batteries. Just put those in, slide the plate back on, put the four screws back on, and we're ready to go. All that's left is to switch the two units on. You've got power switch on the base of the receiver unit. Uh, go to the left for centigrade, right for Fahrenheit. And to switch on our clip, unplug it, the power button is next to the socket, simply hold down the button for a second and you'll get a flash. And if you want to check that the unit's on, again just press the button quickly and it will flash and tell you that it's on. And when you want to switch it off, just hold it down for five seconds and it will flash to tell you that it's off. 